ladies and gentlemen, my name is Allison Cruz, and welcome to the finale of the game. There's nothing else to say, but let's go ahead and get started and confront our fate at the Haltman Works main office, I guess, is what they call it. <laughs> oh, and is, we're in for a bit of a doozy fight here, because if you're not careful, it'll kind of mess you up. But you have many abilities you can choose from, and like most other Kirby games, you can go back to another stage, grab an ability, chance it with chance time, and then come back here, so no worries. If you didn't see something you didn't like there, then you can go grab another one elsewhere. But as we enter this door, we actually don't confront the boss yet. Hmm. Instead, we get to take a really neat elevator. Because why not? It's cube-powered and... <laughs> Of course, it's the most direct method of transportation. Oh. It's kind of weird. <laughs> uh, but that door led us to an elevator. That led us to a teleporter. So, let's take this and confront our fate, shall we? <sighs> Doesn't really look like much. <laughs> well, thanks. It kind of more looks like that than a main office, but. Yeah. Can you stop calling me that, please? Hmm. Why would you assume that? I'm a creature of mass destruction, man. Oh. Wow. You mean... <laughs> a re-repeat of a boss that we already fought before? Wow. So essentially you created the iPhone 5S. Or you can call it the Mecha Knight Plus. Bye, really? So, ladies and gentlemen, the rematch against Mecha Knight. This time, he is a bit more of a maverick, and I would be careful with how you approach him because he doesn't really change his moveset all that much, at least not until you get to the second phase where he does have something a little bit different that doesn't make any logical sense, but. Again, I would recommend probably Hammer here, because he moves around just enough to be annoying, and he has a couple of swooping moves, and... Oh, no, no crash waves to kill me. Uh, okay, so he's gonna be doing this for a while. Damn it. Let me kill you, please. And overall, it's not really that bad, but once you get him down to about two-thirds health, for whatever reason, he sprouts a giant hand from his back. Which doesn't make any sense. What practicality does this function? And it, it doesn't make sense. But what you can do is you can get up right next to his face. And this is going to be bad because I'm taking too much damage here. And you can actually avoid taking damage if you're in a certain spot. Right here. Perfect. So you can actually hit both of them at the same time here. And if you can get them locked in this loop of trying to attack you, they will never hurt you. And of course I failed, but did just enough damage that we took him out anyways. So that's great. Poor guy. Never stood a goddamn chance. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Twice. Yeah, I think you got a bit of a glitch in the system there. Susie. Oh, your own extremities. <laughs> Oh god, were you watching this entire time? <laughs> it's like, why does nobody ever notice me? I'm in the center of the room. <laughs> Alright, well, looks like Susie's out of a job. Sucks for her. <laughs> She's like, aww. Poor Susie. Hmm. 
very impressive. <laughs> Clever. Can you quit calling me that, please? Oh god. <laughs> Truly marvelous indeed. Dream. That sounds a little familiar. <laughs> oh God. Oh God, no. <laughs> So ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to present to you the fight against President Haltman in his gymmed Robobot suit, which for some particular reason bears a very strong resemblance to the fight we had against Susie in World 3, which is, you know, not really a bad thing, but it would have been nice to see something a little bit more original than, you know, a rehash fight. But essentially, it is exactly the same, and oh, that was dumb. That was so dumb. I am screwing up left and right here. We are going to want to not take too many hits here, although, there we go. After you take down about a fourth of his health, he's going to start being a little more of a maverick. Hmm. Where are your arms, dude? <laughs> so, yeah, you would probably want to be a little bit careful with your health usage here, because this guy can kind of combo you. I mean, it's not very hard, but your health does carry over from the previous fight, so... Let's go ahead and... Wow, he, he dodged that with such finesse. Yeah. Okay. Not doing a great job defending me there, friend. <laughs> His little scream. That's insane. Oh my god. There we go. Okay. So he's almost done. Which means now... Oh, he's just gonna shoot off a bunch of his cronies. Oh, and this one sucks because you have to actually turn backwards so that you avoid them like that. That's right. He only sends them out in limited quantities. Oh, and also he's gonna be raining money everywhere. Boy, really is hard to see with all these Haltman bucks in front of my face. I'm rich! Nah, he's, he's not really that bad in this phase. This is probably his easiest one just because you don't have to worry too much about you know, really stupid moves. He just kind of walks into you and lets you beat him up. So with one more hit, I believe, we'll be in the final phase. I was gonna say something else, but there we go. So you can give him a nice little light nut tap there. <laughs> this is where it gets a little bit interesting. So you wanna hide in the corners here because what? Oh, maybe not now. Oh yeah, in the corners because yeah. Uh oh. Now this third one. This third one, you want to be careful? He sounds like he's in such pain. Who hurt you, Haltman? Who did this to you? <laughs> okay, now he's going to start searing through the center here. And oh god, I forgot about that. Okay. So, we just need to probably hit him one more time and then, and then we're good. And with that, uh, we beat him. <laughs> My God. Okay there, Britain. Savages! Savages!
You do realize I'm the only small pink creature of mass destruction, right? I mean, there aren't many natives. Oh. <laughs> Susie! <laughs> oh. Wow. Keep going, Susie. Good for you. Is that a serious question? <laughs> oh, corporate spy, jeez. You didn't even have to do anything, you were the secretary. Great job for you, didn't it, Susie? <laughs> beep beep boop. Now we have the Spelunky music playing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Technically, the age of history, the present. <laughs> okay, I will try. <laughs> That's all I wanted to do, I promise. Yeah, I'm sure you did. That lesson was it sucks getting your brain taken over by a supercomputer. <laughs> No, I'll destroy myself, thank you very much. Oh, it looks like we're now on a nickname basis. Okay. Wait, why does my name have to be Pinky? Whatever. Now for my final trick. Yes. 